Sean Schleck from One here and welcome back. I am very excited for our new movie reaction. Today we are watching, if you have not seen the title or read the thumbnail, today we are watching Grave of the Fireflies. Now, I have heard this is probably one of the most depressing anime movies, if not in the top ranks of depressing anime movies. I don't know the ending. I feel like I've seen the ending. So I think someone dies. I think a little boy dies. I I don't really know anything about this this show or this movie. I basically just have heard it's really, really sad. That's all I've heard. So I am going into this kind of blind. Like I said, I've seen a couple clips. I've seen um, a clip of them eating some sort of candy and a clip of them, like the little boy laying down and either being sick or dying or something like that. So I, again, have no context other than that. So I'm excited to get into it. So sit back, grab a snack, and enjoy my first time watching Grave of the Fireflies. Ooh, okay. September 21st, 1945. That was the night I died. Wait, what? Wait, did they both die? Oh my gosh. Um. Don't. Another one. Is this just normal? When they die? You just. Huh? That's the candy thing I saw. What is this stuff? Never mind that. Just dump it. What the hell? What is inside that? Was that... It was white, but it looked like bone, maybe? Oh, his little boy I saw. Oh my gosh, what? this is such a mind game. What is going on? It... Is, that, is that like candy? Or is that, cause it looks like, oh yeah, it is candy. Cause I was thinking like a soup, like how it's kind of, it's kind of like spam, but it's a soup. Aww. Oh, that's a girl. I thought that was a boy. Shelter. Yeah. So be careful, Satan, and get over there as soon as you can. Setsuko, be a good girl and listen to your brother. Mom, never mind Why? us. Get to the shelter. Why are you not taking your daughter with you instead of leaving her Do here you with have him? Your medicine with you? I have it right here. Don't worry. Yeah. <laughs> well, you'll be sorry if you get blown up by a bomb. <laughs> Wow, it was like, you'll be sorry if you don't. But why? My doll. Oh, my doll. we've got a lot of things to worry about right now. What was that then? Go, go, boy, move. Oh! Oh shit! Why? <clears throat> Why didn't they all just go together to the shelter? Why did he stay behind? Oh, God, <sighs> Where are you guys going that's... And now they're shoving. I'm just, I'm so speechless. I don't... 
I don't know where they're gonna go that's any better. Oh my god. Where are you going now? Oh, he's just finding. Oh! Oh, she's so scared! Oh my god, don't show me somebody burning. I'm... I really hope so because honestly kilo bomb easy. Don't worry about her. I would be only because she literally left minutes before that all happened. I don't know that she got there and she'll probably go to Nippon Matsu station to find us. We'll go and meet her there. That was the center call. We ate lunch there once. Probably. What do we do? <sighs> Dad'll make him pay for this. So their dad's still alive, he's just fighting. Oh my god! That's a freaking image! To the elementary school for first aid services. Okay. What's wrong? What are you Don't Probably from the debris. We'll get it washed out at the school. Where's Mama? She'll be there. Let's go. <gasps> yes, let's go. It makes me scared because I don't think she's there. Wasn't that scary, Setsuko? Oh, I, I'm sorry. I thought that was his mom standing next to them. To go somewhere. We'll wait for him together. Oh. So she really did. See, is she gonna fucking die? You're in the wrong room. I don't. I'm glad you're here. Are you okay? My mom. This way. <sighs> oh. Strong. This is your mother's, isn't it? <gasps> Why? What does that mean? Oh my god! <gasps> Holy! Fucking shit, dude. Oh my god, see, I knew because she that happened minutes. We can't do much. I don't think they've hit Kaisei Hospital in Nishinomiya. My mother, my mother has heart trouble. Can she get her medicine? I'll find out. Keep this ring in your purse. Don't lose it, okay? That's your mom's ring. Mom's been hurt, Setsuko. But she'll get better soon. Where, where is she? In the hospital, in Nishinomiya. We'll stay here at the school tonight. Then tomorrow, we'll go to stay at our aunt's house near the hospital. Is that okay? <sighs> Sweetie, no, not right now. Maybe tomorrow. It's I was gonna say, I really don't think you should see your mama right now. We haven't unbandaged her. Believe me, you don't want to see the body. Bad. We're having, she'll have to go on the truck today. There's, <sighs> there's bugs all over her. And now the little girl can't see her mom. I mean, she, granted, I don't think again that she should see her in this state. Where's your sister? Nishinomiya. We have a distant aunt there. I think she'll take care of us. I see. Lucky for you. I better get back to work. Wait. Good luck to you. Wait, 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 wait. Did I just fucking process? 
Did th no, wait, okay. Wait. Did I, am I a dumbass or did they, did they just, what? Did they burn the mom's body and that's where Ash is? Oh my gosh, I love this aunt. Like, she's doing, she's being a normal, you know, what should be a normal, like, family member of being so kind and helpful, but I really appreciate it. Oh, oh no way. Oh, that was so smart. That's why he was doing that. Because he was preserving food. So now would they have food because he stored it underground and it didn't get hit. And those are the candies. So this is like all the rubble. Bonito? Herring? Dried potatoes? Wait a second, isn't herring a fish? Wow. How did you get herring to stay fresh? And I do believe this is butter. How bad? My mom died while she was still at the school. What? She's dead? Okay, so she did die. Then why didn't you tell me? Why were you hiding it? Answer me, child. Dude, what the hell do you mean? He was probably going through some shit. Like, granted, yes, he should have said something, but like, I just. So she did fucking die. And that was her ashes or something he was carrying around. That's what that was. Oh my gosh. And then. She's dead. How awful. Well, you best write your father and tell him. Well, don't be a bitch about it now. I feel like she kind of sounded condescending when she said that. My neighbor Totoro, too. What is with the joint baths? What is that about? Because that doesn't make a whole lot of sense to me. Like, again, it, maybe it's a cultural thing. Maybe it's a time period thing. Maybe it's, you know, like that because she's so young. But it just seems odd to me. It's, it's like, let, let me know in the comments below because I'm genuinely kind of curious because I've seen it now in this and my neighbor Totoro. Well, don't crush it. Don't crush it. Did you kill it? Oh, you killed it. You squashed it. You squashed it. Don't squeeze so hard. Wow. Hey, Satsuko, close your eyes and say ah. Why should I? Come on. I don't want it. What? Ah. Oh, I thought he was. I thought the firefly was gonna go in her mouth. Okay, he's gonna put the candy in. Oh my gosh! Yay! No. Oh. Cooking. Where were you two? Taking a night walk. Did you thank the lady? Yes, ma'am. She's gonna- is she gonna piss me off? Like, I- I really liked her in the first few minutes. Why is she being... What? Seta, shouldn't you be going to school? Or something? Yeah, but the steelworks they had me working in was bombed. And my school burned down. Uh-huh. There's no place to go. Mm hmm Well, I hope you've written to your father. I did that. I sent it through the naval office. Well... Just after we came here. Um, I guess it was about ten days ago. That seems strange. There should have been a reply by now. Hmm? But it's... It, okay, first Return of all... The scissors when you I don't know how the mail system is going to be that fast, but he said ten days. It's not like it's been a month or a year. It's been ten days. With him, how many people live in this house? You work for our country's defense too, young lady. Eat up and work as hard as you can. Goodness, no wonder food's so rationed around here. There's like five, five people to feed. 
Oh shit! Could you talk any louder? What's wrong? You got an itch? Just hang on. We'll be out of here soon enough. Oh, is she's gonna throw it at him? Oh, I thought she was throwing sand at him. Sea salt. Oh, collecting salt, it? Salt and soy sauce is ration. All right, hurry up, set to go. What? Is that how uh, soy sauce works? What is that rash? Good, right? You want it now? Huh. Oh, is it salt? He was putting salt on. It. Careful, careful, careful. Oh, careful. Okay, I thought I, I, I'm so nervous because she's like four. She, I'm worried she's gonna go too deep. Uh, <laughs> go back, go back, go back, go back, go back. Don't look at that. Don't. No, no. No, no. When it gets a little warmer, I'll teach you how to swim. Let's get home before we're caught in the next air raid. I'm tired. Carry me. Yeah. Air raid! Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. See, we don't have time to stop and do this. Go, 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 go! Your mother will not be needing her kimonos anymore, Santa. Why don't you? Why did you say that right in front of little sister? Like she's asleep, but why did you come in here and say that? You can probably get a full toe of rice for them. That much? Setsuko, let them go. Setsuko, Setsuko, no, Setsuko. What? Did she split it? Did, is it like... <laughs> Ow. Did she split it so that it's like they get half of the rice and they get the other people get half the rice? or Because those were his mom's kimonos. So why did you get half? Or is it because she's taking care of them? Probably because she's taking White care of them. White rice, Etsuko! <laughs> oh. She's so sad. She's not in the mood. I was gonna say they have plenty, so she can have seconds. You're just gobbling it down tonight, aren't you, Setsuko? She's a growing girl. Oh my gosh, yeah, make um rice balls and rice cakes and stuff, yeah. Do we have any more of those pickled plums? Oh, we finished those off ages ago. Oh. Hi. Here's your lunch. Thanks. I better get rice. Going. Everybody gets rice. Bye, mom. Take care. Oh. We'll have rice balls for lunch. Just hold on till then. You mm -hmm. stop that. You'll have porridge for lunch too. What the hell? A lazy slug like you deserves the same as people who are working so hard for our nation. Okay, well, don't be a bitch about it. He's watching his sister. Oh my god. Fine. Here's a new rule. From now on, we'll just make our own dinners. Are you kidding me? Santa, you have other relatives in Tokyo, don't you? On your mother's side of the family. Why not write to them? <sighs> What's wrong? Okay. 
You're gonna give her candy again? There's a fruit drop. Mom has 7,000 yen in the bank. 7,000? That's more than enough for us to live on. Yeah, Let's see, so her. maybe her freaking sister can shut her mouth. I'm telling Dad to write back soon because you're waiting. That is so freaking cute. Okay, I also want to mention something else that I understand the aunt's point of view in some senses. I was a little bit harsh on her right off the bat. Like I said, I get that she's got two more mouths to feed, two more kids to care for, two more people in her family that she has to house. Um, she's got the worries of the bombings and she's also, you know, taking on this extra work when the brother's not being able to do like any work or go to school or help out in any way. I understand she's frustrated and I get it. And like, she's valid, but at the same time, I'm kind of a fr frustrated with her because one, like you decided this, you took on this responsibility, not to mention those kimonos were their mom's dresses. So that rice was technically for them because you told them they should sell the dresses to get that rice for them. And not to mention, you're yelling at a four-year-old. Like, four-year-olds will be upset if they get the wrong dinosaur chicken nugget. I mean, you can't, you can't get upset with a four-year-old like that over them. You, you just, I don't know who she's mad at. Like... You keep on your own business. What are they up to? They're doing their own. Good for them. It's about time. More, please. Mom, did you ever scold them again? Yes, and they refuse to apologize. And that boy, he even bought a stove. Just to spite me. You literally, oh my god, you literally just fucking told him to cook his own meals. How is he supposed to do that without a stove? Finished. Oh. We can sit any way we want. Doesn't matter. <laughs> she just like moves her leg halfway out. Great. Don't. They've left the dishes for me to do. So selfish. Honestly, those little rats are two of the worst. Oh, not again. Santa, please. That man and my daughter were hard for our nation all day long. We can't have. What are you so upset about? Oh shit! Every freaking five minutes! Damn it! God! We just can't catch a freaking break! Don't have a house to go back to. With a great big streamer shaped like a carp in the wind. Oh, he's teaching her how to play piano, With kind a great of. Big streamer shaped like a carp in the wind. The big ones, the papa, and the little ones, the kids. Stop it! We what? You realize that there is a war going on. You two are nothing but trouble for God. Can they not have one piece of joy? A couple of pests. That's what you are. Holy girl! We bothered you long enough. We should be leaving now. Yeah. Leaving? Yeah. For where? I haven't really decided yet. Oh. Well then, you two. Bye bye. Mm -hmm. Take care of yourself. Sure. Just leave it right there. Ooh. Do you think maybe you can sell my sister and I some food and maybe some straw? I guess not much left though. What if you bargain? What if you ask him if he can work for like a day and you can get free food and like straw? Oh, they got a well! Oh, dude. They're gonna be so stacked for water. Ooh, and they got their rice and their cooker. 
And maybe you could find a fish in there. What can make him do with his freaking situation? I will give him that. I want to see. Ooh. Ooh. They also could cook a frog. Have frog legs. Well, I guess we can always eat frogs. Frog. What am I saying? They're great. Or you can, like, and you can take you baths in the water. So pretty. Hey, let's get as many as we can. Wow. Can you imagine sleeping under that? I'd be a little ick about it because I don't like bugs, but. I mean, look at that. It's like looking up in the night sky. Wow. Fortresses floating on the sea, defending our homeland from invaders near and far. Enemy plane! Ah. Ah. Wow. Okay. I wonder where Dad is fighting now. Yeah. Oh, she passed out. She was out. Doesn't wanna. There's a whole cave here. There's a whole shelter here. Spread out. Digging? What you doing? Making a grave. Mama's in the grave too. How does she know that? Oh gosh. How does she? She said Mama died and she's in the grave now. What the hell? Why the fuck did she tell her that? Like, you didn't even... What the fuck? I've traded everything for rice. Even my mom's kimono. There's nothing left to trade. Please, I can pay you good money for the rice. Sorry. I can't trade or sell anything to you. I'm a farmer, but even I don't have any rice to share. <laughs> You're the son of a navy man, right? So try to be brave. What is that? Is this stealing? It's probably stealing, though. Again. This is probably stealing. Aww. That's so sweet. Oh, he's got a washboard. I didn't notice that. Oh, and like I said, fish. You can have fish. She have... Does she have lice? Oh god, she has lice! It doesn't matter if you like it or not, you have to eat. You need to. Sweetie. Oh god, sweetie! I'm sorry! Oh. Sir, forgive me! I didn't mean to! Dude! My sick. I just wanted to get her some sugar! Yeah, sure. Stealing food is serious crime in Walter. Oh my god! You goddamn! Come back here! What the hell, potatoes too? So you're the one who's been. Oh my god! No! I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'll never do it again. I swear. Tell it to the cops. I'll take you there myself. Dude, she, what about her? No, I please. Hope they lock you up. Please, she's sick. What about her? She needs me. Move. Dude! Officer! You've knocked this poor kid around enough. I'm even tempted to call it... Uh, assault. 
assault thank you sir of a minor too i'm pretty sure he's he might be a minor they hit for Kui tonight you know would you like a glass of water or something can you take him back to her his sister like now Oh God, she's been there. She found her way. <laughs> Wait, what is he? Oh, is he stealing from them? Oh no, 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 don't do that. Don't do that. Oh my god, I know you're desperate. Don't, because you know she'll... Oh god. You know she'll stir shit. Don't do that. Oh my god, don't fucking tell me she's dead. I swear on my life. I swear. Setsuko, dinner. Don't fucking tell me. I swear on my life. I'm not... This pumpkin's great. Tastes like sweet bean jelly, or... I'll take you to the beach again, Setsuko. She's gotta be so sick. What is she sick from? Is it the the smoke and God? Can we fucking win for one time, please? No, oh, she's gonna fucking find out. He's looting when everybody's in a pan. Is he losing it? I'm a little scared. What are you doing? What are you doing? Stop on me here. God. He's got to stay with his sister. He's got to. Where is she? What are you doing? Is she just napping? What is she doing? And out. She is so skinny and so thin and so bitten up. She's been having diarrhea for a while now. Prickly heat and rashes all over. And salt water seems to be hurting her skin. Yeah. Malnutrition? Next patient. Can you give her medicine or a shot? What is he supposed to do? Help her. Give her medicine. All this child needs is some food. She needs food. How can I help you? You do not just start taking the next food. You don't just start taking the next fucking case when he's still standing there. Should see me. Anything else? Oh, ice cream. Also, I want fruit drops. Oh, fruit drops. Okay. What are we gonna do? Where are we gonna get it? I'll withdraw the money and buy you all the food you need. Huh. So why didn't he take out this money sooner? Like, he said that his mom had like 7,000. What was, I guess he was buying other food for the whole time. So they're in supporting them. The There's a typhoon coming. That's great. We get our divine win after we surrender. Figures. Surrender? You great. mean we've lost the war? Huh? Haven't you heard, young man? No. What do you mean? You, you need to elaborate. Japan's lost the war? The great Japanese Empire? Yeah. Surrendered unconditionally. Well, what about the fleet? Are they... All gone. The whole fleet's been sent to the bottom of the sea, not one Holy shit. What? Hey. Was my dad's ship sunk too? Please tell me. Is that why he hasn't written? How the hell should I know? <laughs> Dude, why are you such a dick? God, and now their dad, is their dad gone? Damn him.
Oh, you are, okay. I'm sorry I'm so late, Setsuko. I'll go ahead and start making up some rice. <coughs> you what? Bought us some chicken. Oh, chicken eggs. Yes. And I also have. Set to go. What's in your mouth? What is in her mouth? What are those? Set to go. What are you eating? What are those? This is a marble. It isn't a drop. Have you been eating those? Fucking peel the watermelon thing and give it to her. Look, look, real food. It's real food. It's fruit. Maybe sit up so you don't choke. No, come on. No, stay with her. It scares me the second he leaves that she's gonna die. Because she's so malnourished at this point. She can't even eat the melon by herself. Is she? She never woke up. She fucking died. She fucking died. There you go. Charcoal for the cremation. Now, since it's a child, make sure you do it at a temple. The body should be lightly dressed and use beanstalks for a good fire. In spite of it all, Lovely day. What the f Shut up! <laughs> she was by herself so much. But he couldn't, he couldn't have done what he needed to do if she wasn't by herself. Well, she was sewing. I didn't even know she knew how to do that. Ooh. That's what he keeps. What's in it? Oh, he does keep it. These are the clothes that he dies in. So this whole family freaking is gonna die. Because we've lost the mom, we've lost the dad, we've lost the little girl, and now he's gonna die too. Oh my gosh, she stayed there all day. Some of Setsuko's ashes into the candy tin and then climbed down the hill. I never went back to the shelter. <sighs> so he's he has that was what was in the jar was her ashes.
God, and that's how they end it. Oh my God. Very good movie. It had me guessing and wondering at every turn. Um, very deep message as far as like what children and, you know, family have to go through during wars. And that was, that was fucking hard to watch at times because they actually showed the bodies burning. They actually showed the mom and how horrific her injuries were. They showed this brother who with all his determination just kept going and going and going and just kept getting beaten down at every fucking railroad. I mean, after his mom passed, he had to take on the, the responsibility of taking care of his sister. And then her sister was getting sick and getting lice and getting malnourishment while also they're trying to get, you know, along with their aunt. And then they have to leave their aunt and then they have to, they're trying to write to their dad and he's not writing back. And like, from the minute you hear that, you're like, he's gonna fucking die. And just there's so much death in this movie. Just like, not even just main characters, but death everywhere. And it was just... It was so much. It was so much going on. And that little kid, I mean, the, the fact that she had to see that and go through that, and she didn't even understand. I'm sure she didn't even understand what was going on. She just saw the pain, and she saw her brother being, you know, beaten, and she saw her brother's wounds, and she, you know, just, mm, it just there's so much. I really enjoyed that. I'm so glad I checked it out, even for as, like, dark and vivid and depressing as it, it sounded and it was, I feel like it's, it's a Studio Ghibli movie that does deserve some respect because it has a really interesting message. It has a really interesting point of view that you see. And it, most of all, I mean, it's just, it's a really engaging story. And honestly, I could watch that over again. Not because it wasn't sad, but because it was just, it was, it was such an impactful and such a beautiful story and just, I don't know what else to say. It, it was, it wasn't a good time, but it was a, it was a good story and it, I really enjoyed getting a chance to sit and experience it for the first time. Um... But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed and um, I hope that you guys, um, you know, enjoyed my react. I hope you guys enjoyed my reaction. And if you did, be sure to leave a like on the video. Um, let me know if other Studio Ghibli movies that you think I should check out because these were the majority of the ones on my list were Grave of the Firefly, Spirited Away, My Neighbor Totoro, and Kiki's Delivery Service were the big ones that I was like, I need, need, need to watch those. Um, other than that, I, I've seen Ponyo. Um, no, oh, when Howl's Moving Castle, I also saw. But, um, other than that, I didn't have any other, like, major Studio Ghibli movies I had to see or had on my list. So let me know in the comments down below if there's any you want me to add to the list. Um, and as I said, if you guys liked the video or, um, just want to see more movie reactions to Studio Ghibli, just be sure to leave a like on the video. And thank you so much for watching. Thank you for staying awesome. And until next time, guys, bye. Don't tell